On this Valentine's Day, you might be thinking about a romantic getaway. After a brutal winter, spring begins less than five weeks from now. Arabella Bowen is the editor-in-chief of Photos Travel. She's here with some ideas for couples. Good morning. Good morning. All right, for couples looking for an ideal romantic voca vacation, you say forget Paris. Yes, forget Paris. Consider Prague instead. Uh, it's a lot less expensive, and it has the same dose of l'amour as the French capital. L'amour. L'amour. They don't say l'amour in Prague, <laughs> no, they don't. It's a beautiful town. Yeah. <laughs> it is a beautiful town, as the pictures will show you. I mean, it's a beautifully preserved medieval city. It is primed for romantic strolls. You're going get, to uh, get to discover amazing wine bars, Art Nouveau cafes where you can spend the afternoon together, uh, fantastic art as well, and a lot of the activities are free. So it's just a great place to visit. Mm -hmm. And if I'm thinking exotic, you say head to Greece. Head to Greece and that beautiful island of Santorini. It is beautiful. It yeah. is beautiful. And Greece is having some really great values this year, so definitely look for deals. Santorini is also on the cruise circuit, so it's a great way to see more than one island on your trip. Mm -hmm. And what we love it for, for romance, is the sunsets. They are legendary. Everyone stops what they're doing at the end of the day to watch the sun descend mm -hmm. over the sea. And as you can see, there are gorgeous plunge pools, too, at many of these hotels. So you can actually mm. just spend the day in the pool, which is a very nice idea on a day like today. I'll take any place that has <laughs> yes. sun at this point. Yeah. Um, you say couples who like adventure and nature should, this one surprised me, head yeah. to northern Chile? Head to northern Chile. The Atacama Desert is unlike anywhere else really in the world and certainly on our list. Um, I actually spent my fifth anniversary there last fall and wow. it was really a trip of a lifetime. The photos don't do it justice. It is rugged, wow, natural beauty. Um, driest place on earth. All the lodges in town are like literally oases in the desert. And, you know, during the day, you can go and swim in a salt lagoon. You can go hiking out to salt flats. You can go horseback riding in the desert. It is really special. I'd never heard of that. Um, no. What about for a foodie couple if you love great food? Definitely want to look at Napa and Sonoma. Nice to know also it has perfect weather almost year round, so there's never a bad time to go. Uh, you want to spend your day going out to all the vineyards. One of the ones I especially love for romance is the Domaine Chandon. You can go mm -hmm. and have bubbly there on an outdoor have you terrace. Been, Nora? Oh, yes. You, I, got been? I got engaged in oh, that. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you said, mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know that one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Yeah, it is wonderful. And of course, as you know, the restaurants out there are first class, gorgeous California cuisine. And one tip for saving while out there is to actually consider going for lunch. Uh, it's easier to get a reservation. You'll have very similar menus, and it won't cost as much as dinner. I'm thinking you have such a cool job because you get to go to so many great places. So for the yes. couple who wants no distractions whatsoever, we just want to yeah. be with ourselves, no. Anthony. Yeah. <laughs> just me and Anthony somewhere. Alone somewhere. together. Alone together. Yeah. Well, then go to Petty St. Vincent, deep in the Grenadines, <laughs> in the Caribbean. It is a very remote island. It's going to take you two flights and a boat ride to get to. Oh, two wow. flights, no. I and know, a boat ride, but it's no. so worth Who it. Libraries <laughs> don't work there, though, I hope. Yeah, no Wi Fi, by the way. Awesome. No Wi Fi, no telephone, no television. So you really shut everything down, and it's all about reconnecting with each other and with yourself, really. Um, and the island is trimmed with beaches. There's a beautiful gazebo where you can have dinner. This is a splurge for sure. You want to save up for this, but it is worth every cent. I think we'll do well to go to there, Kate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, the two boat rides. They'll be on the yeah, yeah, like bail after the first boat. Thank See you. Ya. You gave us lots of Thank options. You. Very nice. Good to see you. Good